Anyone can get mad, Chris. Even Shaquille O'Neal. Excuse me. My flapjacks was supposed to have a Superman S on them. Are you mad? I... I can't tell if you're mad. Very mad. This is unacceptable. What's the point of having millions of dollars if everything can't be Superman? Okay. Well, we'll fix it right away. Is there anything else I can get you? Yes. A big ambulance. I am stuck in this booth. Don't forget, I was in that elevator with Jay-Z. Hey, could you have your guy hit two? I gotta get down to the business center to print out my boarding pass. Oh, hey, that's gonna leave a mark. <laughs> that's from a movie. So are you girls traveling with your dad here? Hey, don't kick him, muddy shoes. He's got a white suit on. Hey, look, I don't know if you guys are really staying here, but you can't get into the pool without a room key. Ugh, oh, I should have known Peter had something to do with this. You're not the first person whose life he screwed up. Knock, knock. Nicole, Ronald, who's ready for Boggle? Oh, my God. No. Why? Why? My beautiful Nicole. My man Ronald. Who did this? Oh, man, they were so good together. We were just establishing our friendship. They were about to get engaged. Oh, he was going to ask me to be an usher. I mean, he already had enough groomsmen, so he made me an usher. But just to think I could be involved in the ceremony in any way. Um. All right, we're clear. I'm telling you, man, this shtick is getting so old. That chair smells, dude. Hey, Steve, surf's up! All right, see ya, bitch. Not special? Everyone's special, Peter. Rock drummer Tommy Lee! And if your wife ever tells you that you're not special, punch her really hard right in her hepatitis. Thanks, rock drummer Tommy Lee! Hey, you know what else is cool? Having sex with sunglasses on. I've got a lot of things to try now. Like when I went on that camp out with One Direction. So they checked into their hotel suite, but the minibar had no sparkling water, only still! <gasps> ah, stop. It's too scary. Oh, but that's not all. They looked in the wardrobe and discovered that the stylist had only brought non-skinny jeans! <gasps> Do you mean like a Levi's 513 skinny straight? No, just regular pants that fit normal! <gasps> that's not real, right? Those aren't real. Of course not, Louis. It's, it's just a story. Well, I guess that means these aren't real! <gasps> <gasps> Yeah, they're gonna die in the woods. Simon, are they tagged? They're tagged, right? Oh, they're tagged. Good. Simon, did I ever tell you the one about the loose-fitting T-shirt? No, 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 no! Just like I got kicked out of Coldplay. <laughs> guys, guys, I got an idea. How about we do a song that's not whiny bullcrap? Yeah, so you watch it, Fishman. We are gonna beat you so bad you'll think you gave Chris Brown an STD. Is that what happened? We now return to Joni Loves Chris Brown. Joni, Chris, welcome to the party. Can I offer you some punch? No, thanks. I had some in the car. Joni Loves Chris Brown was taped in front of a very uncomfortable studio audience. Hey, Chris Brown. I just wanted to say I'm a huge fan of your music. This is just going to make me listen more. Oh, hey, Ray Rice. Would you mind pressing lobby? What do you got, potatoes in your ears? I said press lobby. Obviously, the second happiest. Now we gon' do this thing a little different tonight. You gon' come over, pick me up in your eye. Oh my god, I wasn't even supposed to be here. I passed out at the Tom Petty concert last night and just stayed. You're gonna open my door, and I'ma reach over and open your door. For dinner, take me to see a movie and whisper in my ear how bad you really want to do me. Please go slow. I have IBS. Social drinker, not an alcoholic. Tuh, yeah, that's like saying rappers are really poets. I'm not saying she's a gold digger, but she's not messing with. Who isn't she messing with? All right, what could go wrong? It worked out great for... Listen, I want to throw you the wildest bachelor party of all time. It's going to be crazier than whatever Kanye West is doing at this particular moment. I'm giving this lasagna a massage while preparing to announce I'm joining ISIS. Thank you for your interest. Can you catch us up on all the important things that we've missed?
So no way! Kylie Jenner and Tyga are no longer together? Splitsville, my friend. How did Robert Kardashian die? Guilt cancer. From what? Oh boy. So people thought the dancing Judge Edos were funny? For a while, yes. Is Leno still doing it? No, he's not hosting anymore. Oh, so Conan got the Tonight Show? <sighs> oh, come on. Okay, I'll put the Kanye Canes in the stockings. You know, it's just like, you know, music and fashion, all that. You know, I can't be stopped. Whatever I do, you know, I just want to be the best because the best is never enough. Mark Zuckerberg promised he'd give me $50 million, fam, but then he welts and I'm penniless. Kanye is the greatest. Kanye drops the latest. There can be no debaters, and Kanye got the... St you tweet things that aren't worth tweeting. Well, I'm sorry, but Kim Kardashian did get famous for making a sex tape. We all know that. That's not yours. What is that? It's my magic eight ball. This is the first black ball that Kim Kardashian hasn't played with. New streaming world. No! No! <gasps> Kim, what's wrong? A black ball went to waste. Wow! It looks like Michael Jackson's coming right at me! When Michael Jackson needs a rush, he humps a guy like me! Stewie, did Mr. Jackson behave inappropriately toward you? Well, yes, but the worst part was he never called back. <laughs> <laughs> No, but uh, in all seriousness, yeah, he was actually pretty aggressive. Even more aggressive than Michael Jackson's treatment of his own groin on stage. Thank you. A bigger hit with the kids than Will Smith in his nice, clean rap. Woo! Ha <laughs> ha! I respect women when I'm on a date. I take them to the park or maybe a museum, and I only try to kiss them if they're ready. Woohoo! What, 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 what is it? What, what? Help out your mom and dad by getting a job so you can help pay for school supplies. Woohoo! Say ho! Wipe your shoes on the mat when you come in the house. Someone just clean that floor. Woohoo! Say what, what? Ha <laughs> ha! I've been in uncomfortable situations before, like whenever I meet famous people. Hey, what's up? I'm Snoop Dogg. Know what I'm saying? I do! But you don't, Peter. You don't. This is the Seth Rogen gene. It will give you the appearance of being funny even though you haven't actually done anything funny. Hey, Doc, are we going to be much longer? i got to get some beers with the fellows before I go out on this date. <laughs> How charming and chubby. I'm rooting for you. Wow, look at that HD picture. Yeah, it's so clear you can even see Ellen DeGeneres' breath. Well, my guest today is uh, Seth Rogen, who's got a new movie out. Now, now, Seth, this movie is hot. It's just hot, hot, hot. Uh, how does it feel to have the hottest film in Hollywood? What the it's the coolest George Clooney there is. Hi, George Clooney, second worst Batman. Peter Griffin, second best Homer. You may have heard, I'm also known for my practical jokes on the set. One time, I nailed Nora Dunn in the head with an apple. <laughs> that, that's hilarious, because you're handsome. Otherwise, you're just some dick who hit a lady. It's more ridiculous than the theory of why Tom Cruise runs in all his movies. Wow, that cameraman has nice, strong arms. You can't catch me, gay thoughts in a nightclub? Good, you're more out of place than Prince was on The Price is Right. And what's your bid on the dining room set, Prince? 350. I'm sorry? 350. Can you speak up, please? 350. All right, and the actual retail price of the dining room set is $350. Yay. Oh, oh, we, we gotta get you to the hospital. Ah, ah, you're hideous. Who did this to you? Oh, oh, where are my keys? Where's my keys? Where are my keys? Peter, what about Babs? Forget about yourself for a second, Carter. Look what has happened to Jonathan Lipnicki. Oh, yeah. No, you, you, 